hello guys and welcome to make easy and today i will show you how to upload your static sites on heroku server so the heroku is a server platform you can upload your sites or you can applications and make it into live so you will find some sign up button so first we need to register into heroku and you need to fill some basic fields and then you can create your free account so already i have an account i'm going to log in With the email and password and this is my Sudoku dashboard and already I uploaded some couple of sites and two applications and on this application on Heroku so right now I'm going to show you how to up upload new static site on Heroku okay first up here I'm going to creating my and HTML file inside Heroku folder. So touch index.html. So now I'm going to open this Heroku.html folder into my text into my editor. This is my index.html. Here I'm writing the code. This is my simple HTML. I'm going to write in the title of my page. With Heroku application. So then H1 Heroku app. So okay, some style text align at center. Okay, first I need to initialize. So first I need to initialize. So with a git in it. Okay, git. Init. So now I initialize my empty repository. So I initialized an empty repository right now. So then I need to add. I need to. So now I need to check the status. So here you see the index.html is an untracked file. I need to track this one. So it dot. So now you check the status. It is tracked. Now I need to commit this one. Git commit minus m. So this is an index file. So now, so if you already an account, so now first at the first time you need to log in into Heroku. So Heroku login. So now here you need to enter the Heroku login and password means email and password. So then password. So now everything is correct. So now you need to do the name of your application. So Heroku apps create and name of your application. So dev snips app. So now it's created dev snips app dot heroku app dot com. So now I need to push into Heroku server. So git push Heroku master. So here I got an error. So no default languages could be so detected for this application. Yes, so we need to use one default application, so default language like PHP, Ruby, or Scala, Go, or Java, so what it may be. So now we need to create one so PHP file for this. So touch index.php. Now I created one PHP file. This is a PHP file. Here I'm going to include in some code. 
so like php so we include once index.html so now again check the git status so index.html so index.php is an untracked file so I need to add that one into my repository git add so now I added I need to commit so index php file this is then now I need to upload into here server git push here master So now it is successfully uploaded into Heroku. So if I refresh, so I find one more application is added like devsnips.app.php. So because of I created one index.php file. Okay, now I need to see when I click on this. I'm going to open my application. Open application. Heroku app. So, and the URL is DevSnips app. So, it is we are going to create first the so name of the application, then the extension with dot Heroku app dot com. Thank you guys and thanks for watching. I hope you like the video and please subscribe to make easy.